we're doing some uh, barbecue smoked ribs today slash you know right here as you can see we're smoking right now but uh, we're gonna cook them in about 275 for two and a half hours we're gonna roll them into some tin foil wrap them another two hours coming off the grill and we're going to Mau Town Mau Town is you know your Mau and your eating that's gonna be great um, so what I've done here is I've already kind of started I clean up my ribs and make them nice and uniform these ones look not too bad sometimes you get the nubs on the end I hack get rid of that make it nice and square so they cook even and everything but these are pretty clean now we got to remove the membrane folks I'm gonna show you how we do that so we clean that up there a little bit are you rolling there John oh yeah and then here clean out I just you just kind of come into it here and you grab it like that and see it just kind of rips off sometimes it comes off easier but that right there I'll tell you what that uh, that's Peace River skate laces we used to use these back in the day on the farm and uh, tire skates eh? just kidding um, so I just kind of clean that up you just kind of grab a corner pinch on it a little bit and the membrane just comes off because this here what this will actually do you guys is it'll leave a fatty kind of a film on your mouth if you get into it and eat it it's kind of rough but um, sometimes yeah right here see you just grab it give it a little bit of a go there just like that see there we are so we get that off membrane off one that also allows the spices to penetrate better into the meat and everything like that and uh, yeah it'd be fantastic I apologize for the wind here today it's a little windy blows a little on the mic there but that's okay we're hanging with the chemise nobody cares here we're laid back and here to cook eh? you guys now uh, this one here I've got like a it's kind of a rub there I concocted it's got uh, seasoning salts uh, yeah a little cayenne paprikas in there salt peppers garlics you name it it's all in there good stuff I just I put lots of this on you guys because we are going to do some spritz in here with apple cider vinegar a little bit of apple juice as you can see I worked that in really nice now I want to show you guys a little something we got going on we'll just hit it there like that as you can see coming together really nice guys work that in good give it a little rub now I'll let this sit here for approximately half an hour or so give or take and uh, you know just to let the, the, the rub kind of set in I don't I don't ever it looks great it does look great John I never rub it down more than an hour uh, before I cook it now have a look here John oh we already got one in there simmering just have a look at that folks look at that wow, looks great just like a big old gator nose in there looking back at you hey <laughs> just fantastic so take these glasses off here so you can take me seriously now we got our fixings here we're on the tailgate I'm loving it out here it's uh, been the first day without rain in the longest time so I'm enjoying it just get out make a mess have a good time and now I've done a lot of racks of ribs in my day and uh, so I experiment with lots of things this next rack we're going to do we're going to do a little uh, kind of a, just a pepper we're going to put black pepper on it you guys and then when we bring it off we're going to salt it so it's going to be like a salt and pepper wing almost but in a rib trust me it's really good and uh, we're going to drench a couple of these in a butter bath and uh, a couple of little tricks like that it's going to be fantastic so I'm going to get this prepped up I'm going to get them on the on the queue here the smoker so yeah we'll see you shortly don't go far look at this smoke you guys isn't that fantastic are you filming yeah oh you are right on here we are you guys just going to wash up my knife <laughs> we just do our old school out here i'll oh. tell you i don't fool around there we go okay. get that nice and clean just like so so what i'm doing here you guys is i like to do a, a shout out to big john watson uh, who made the pickled sausage there, the chemi style. Look at that, you guys. John, I'm glad you made it. I see you slid Dodi a jar. That's good. He'll enjoy it too. That's awesome. I appreciate the support. Oh, I'll tell you what. That pickled sausage is deadly. Mm, you guys, enjoy it. John, thanks for everything. Right on, you guys. See you soon. Here we are, folks. I just wanted to take a good shot on the side here for a little while. Just have a look in there. I'll tell you what. Just listen to that thing purring, eh? Look at just starting to do its thing. It's gonna get a bit of a smoke ring going there. Got the pepper one, got our Chevy special seasoning on there. A little garlic, a little GSP garlic salt pepper on these ones. Uh, a little paprika too, a few little goodies in there. Remember with the Chevys, you guys, use what you like, cook what you like. You know your spices, if you don't like it too spicy, you're not into the ring sting, don't put no cayenne pepper in there. You know, just eat it the way you like it. 
Okay, I have a bit of apple cider here. Let's go. I was going there, guys. Here we go. We're a little bit windy. I apologize for that. I apologize for that. Johnny, come on in. Let's have a little look. See here, we're running about 275 on them rip there for about two and a half hours, folks. We got a little apple cider here. Vinegar going. And I just give that a little pad just like that, as you can see. Now that's going to tenderize that up real nice, you guys. Really nice. Look at that. I just do this right on here. I uh, lost my sprayer. I don't know what happened to it, but so I'm doing our old school with the brush here, as you can see. Oh, that's going to be good, you guys. Oh, that smells amazing. Oh, isn't that beautiful, John? I'll tell you what, you guys, it's uh, fantastic. What we're going to do here real soon is we're going to lay that into some tin foil with some brown sugar, some honey, and some butter. And we're going to give it two hours in that tin foil, and then we're going to take that out. We're going to cut it. We're going to oh, get some rice going, maybe some broccoli. Oh, that's a bad word, isn't it? Really? Broccoli, you're thinking? Did he just say that? But yeah, you know, 45 now, I need some need some health, eh? Well, look, we got a dirt biker going through the community here and everything. Right on, right on. Good man. Okay, anyhow, we'll be back. So here we have it, guys. We've wrapped this one up in brown sugar, honey, and uh, butter uh, inside that one. This is our salt and pepper one. We're gonna wrap this one, and we're gonna do that one right there, you guys, just in butter no other flavors that's gonna be a salt and pepper rib it's gonna be great this one here we're gonna take over right now butter brown sugar honey and teriyaki so come on with me just look at that you guys this is professional just unbelievable hickory smoke oh I love the hickory in the ribs come on follow me over here guys so you just lay that right in there just like so now here come over here and have a quick look at this we got honey brown sugar you name it actually I forgot the honey I'll be right back Okay, sorry guys, I forgot some of the fixings there, but don't uh, don't hold it against me, I'll tell you what. It's been a busy day cooking, getting lots of phone calls, people wanting to cook, do ideas. We're gonna do an awesome Italian meatball sub here, or uh, sausage, not a meatball. Now I just use a little honey, as you guys can see. You don't want a whole lot, just lay it in there, like so, with the brown sugar. Just have a look there, you guys, that's just whole, whole professional. So that'll just add some sweet, some honey. Honey always goes good with the pork, you guys. Just great. Uh, come on in here, John. Just look at this, you guys. A little apple cider vinegar. It's just tender. It's wanting to fall apart right now, but we'll just do that. Now, if you, here's a little chemi tip. If you see here, it's hard to see where the bones are, so that's what you always do right there. You flip it over and you can follow that with a knife and get nice even cuts. It's just fantastic. Now this one, the kids love it, so I'm going to do it for the kids. You tune it in <laughs> right on. Okay, John. We're just going to lay a little bit of teriyaki in there. Just a bit to soak in and flavor in. As you can see, it goes underneath there nice. Perfect, you guys. Perfect. That is going to be so good. Just look at that. Oh, I'll tell you what. And we're just going to take this. Watch how you do this, you guys. I hope you guys are watching at home. Oh, right there. Seal that up nice. Hold it over. Wrap it up. Just like so, nice and tight and snug in there. Look at that, you guys. So that's going on for another two hours. We'll see you in two hours. I'm just gonna wrap these other ones up, the salt and peppers, guys, and I'll tell you, it's gonna be great. We're gonna have some rice with that. And I don't know if we're doing veggies, we'll see. See kind of a mood I'm in. Come on over here, John. Oh, oh. Right back into that sauna, look at that. Oh, that's aromatherapy. Oh, that hickory, love the hickory. Welcome back to the smoker here. Just come on in here and have a look. Look at them beautiful beans right there. I got bacon in there, onion, brown sugar, cayenne pepper, just a hint. We got a beautiful garlic ham sausage here, locally sourced. Look at that, ready to go. These have been in for about two hours now, you guys, in the tinfoil butter bath with brown sugar, honey. Oh, you guys, I don't even know what to say. It's so good. I just... I love barbecue ribs like this. Is, you couldn't two by four the smile off my face when I tear into these uh, ribs here. It's just, I love it. So we got some creamed corn there as you can see. So I'm gonna bring everything off now guys. We're gonna head to the kitchen. Johnny made us some rice, eh? Thank yeah. you John. He uh, made it. us a little butter bath which will have uh, butter, chipotle, <laughs> garlic, onion, some black pepper. I'll tell you what you guys, we're just gonna drain that over the ribs and use the rest on the rice for the kids. I don't do carbs, but that'll be good. Uh, so it'll be 100% right on guys. See you in the house. 
Here we are, you guys. I'll tell you what, it's been a great day of smoking ribs. Love it. I'll tell you, these pork back ribs here, you guys, ask the girls, are just unbelievable. So we we uh, just can't wait to get into them. We, we pinched a little piece off to one side here, and it was just like melting your mouth good. So fantastic, as you can see. Here we have our uh, regular season one with our GSP, our garlic, salt, pepper, some chipotle, some mango sauce on there, seasoning, salt, all that fun stuff. This one's here is the same, but with teriyaki. And this is just our plain salt and pepper one right there. We ain't gonna do nothing to that. We're just gonna leave that and cut that up and eat that one just the way it is. Now, our teriyaki ones, let's just have a, have a good look here, you guys. See, there we go. So we're gonna flip it so I can follow with the bone. I'm gonna come right in the middle here, you guys. It's gonna be just great, you're gonna love it. I know it, you know it, we all know it. Just look at that. Now this is the teriyaki one, you guys. Come, come in close and have a look at that. Isn't that unbelievable? Just look at that. Look at that beautiful smoke ring. Beautiful smoke ring on that. Oh, like. So good. So, like, you guys, I'm sorry I have to do this in front of you. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, you guys, I can't even tell you. I can't even tell you. Now, that teriyaki, Mm, that brown sugar, that butter. Oh, come, come. Let's do this one next. Here we go. Now, this is what I do, guys. Is I cut this up, get that nicely cut. It's falling apart. Mm -hmm. you, I try not to get them to where they fall apart too much because uh, you like to eat them on the bone, eh? You know. That's okay, you folks. Now look at this. And we just take that and I turn that over. Chipotle. Butter, uh, black pepper, we got some garlic, some onion in there. I'll tell you what, it's just unbelievable. And I just take a little bit of that, just a little bit as you guys can see, and you just pour it over your ribs. Mm -hmm. Oh, you guys, you're not even gonna believe it if I told you. Oh, that one's even better. That's even better. How do you get that even better? <laughs> you guys are hanging with your families. Mm. Smoke barbecue ribs. You gotta invite me over to cook these for you. You're gonna love it. Girls, right on. I'm excited too. Thanks for hanging with the Chemis. I don't wanna keep eating this in front of you guys because it's so good. But uh, there you have it. Two and a half hours, 275 on the, 270, 275 on the smoker into the tin foil. Two hours, I'll tell you what, you guys. Mmm. <laughs> I'll tell you, that's just fantastic. I love you guys. Thanks so much for hanging with the Chemis. Do a shout out for me, girls, please. I can't stop eating this. <laughs> come see us on, uh, come subscribe and follow us. And yeah, love ya. No shammies.